Ah, uh, Arad nods his head approving, like, ugh, ugh. I feel bad, I did something that was approved by Aaron. You hum some more, monsters are drawn to the music? Suddenly, it's a concert. Sans is selling tickets made of toilet paper. Oh, hey day, welcome, welcome. We only just got to Waterfall. So far, so pacifist. Thank you for that vote of faith in my abilities. You hum some more, the seats are sold out. You feel like a rock star. We've already told Rockets off for socialising with actual humans instead of internet humans. The crowd tosses clothing. It's a storm of socks. You hum some more, but the constant attention, the tours, the groupies, it's all... Sharon thinks about her future. We're gonna keep humming. You and Sharon have come so far, but it's time. You both have your own journeys to embark on. You hum a farewell song. It's beautiful. Sharon, I'm gonna miss you. We've done so much together. It's gonna be weird without you. We earn zero XP and 30 gold. There's a rainy statue. We could go back to piano and try to get it this time, but instead we're gonna keep moving forward. We are charging through this pacifist run. Yo, you can't hold an umbrella either. If you're walking anyway, I guess I'll go with you. <laughs> Let's go. This is, oh my God. Man, Undyne is so cool. Yeah, you're definitely purple logical framework. She beats up bad guys and never loses. If you were, if I was a human, knowing she was gonna beat me up would scare the crap out of me. Guys, this is an awkward topic of conversation for us. Monster Kid really doesn't have hands then. Yep. So one time they had a school project where they had to take care of a flower and Asgore volunteered to donate his own flowers and he came to school and taught the class about responsibility. And this kid really wants to see Undyne teach them about beating up all the teachers. But like maybe, maybe not because they're, they're innocent people. They're just doing their jobs, monster kids. We'll continue past this beautiful scenery. Bye, kid. Yo, this ledge is way too steep. But we want to see Undyne, so we will climb on his shoulders. This kid is so understanding. Right, go on, up, up, ski. Adorable little cousin. I can roll with that. Yo, you go on ahead. Don't worry about me. He will find a way to get through. And we have found a save point. Sound of muffled rain on the cave top. It fills you with determination. And here we have a walkway, which has never been bad for us at all. This is slightly alarming. Just a tad alarming. It's not like Undyne is trying to kill us or anything. Also, I was really thinking I could get past that. It. Come along the inside here. Ah! Keep walking. 
up and along. See if we can navigate this maze. Not there. Not there. Must be down. Nope. Nope. We're getting there, guys, I promise. It's not that way. I knew that already, actually. Ah, no! Uh, not there. Along here. We're getting there. We have to head up now. Okay. We are getting there. This definitely isn't a long chase scene at all. And we made it to the end. Monster Kid, unfortunate accident, hatched that way, member of a species without arms, or do they get their arms after their 13th birthday shedding? Interesting. And we fall to our doom. Except... It sounds like it came from over here. Oh, you've fallen down, haven't you? Are you okay? Here, get up. Ash, huh? That's a nice name. My name is... Alas, we woke up. Thankfully, these convenient golden flowers were very convenient. Bloop, 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 bloop. We've already checked out all of the garbage before. And we have found a save point. The waterfall here seems to flow from the ceiling of the cavern. Occasionally, a piece of trash will flow through and fall into the bottomless abyss below. Viewing this endless cycle of worthless garbage, it fills you with determination. We'll head up, all the way up. Seems like a regular training dummy. You want to beat it up? Of course not. So who is falling voice supposed to be? I think it's meant to be Asgore. I'm not certain. Don't, okay, Dark Veracity is like, no, we can't tell you, that's spoilers. And I'm just like, let's spoil, spoil everything. Too intimidated to fight the dummy, huh? The ghost that lives inside the dummy. Cousin used to live inside a dummy too until you came along. And you talked to them, they thought they were in for a nice chat, but the things that you said! Horrible! How could you? It spooked them right out of the dummy! They're going to scare the soul out of our body! Mad dummy blocks the way. And we'll talk to him. Doesn't seem much for conversation. No one is happy about this. Doo -doo -doo. No, don't hit the dummy! Not that he said anything about magic attacks. <laughs> Just ignore that. He'll defeat us and take something. Take our soul, I'm guessing. No! Don't hit the dummy! We must preserve the dummy! He glares into a mirror, then turns to us with the same expression. Use our soul to cross the barrier. Oops. Oh dear. This is such a great fight. I, I guess. I'm bossing around its bullets. He will stand in a lovely human window. Shop window, I should say. Mad Dummy is hopping mad. You can't hurt ghosts no matter what you do. Yeah, but you can turn their attacks back at them. I have actually killed this dummy before. Ah! Ah! Okay, it's such a funny fight. This is true. Uh, we'll have one of our nice creams. You're just great. Your HP was maxed out. 
Yeah, that'll definitely avenge his cousin. Ah, no! Stop hitting the dummy! He glares into a mirror and turns to you with the same expression. What was his cousin's name again? He doesn't quite remember. Mad dummy is getting cotton all over the dialogue box. Whatever! Everything is futile! Don't hit the dummy, okay. Still futile. Yeah, I know how you feel, buddy. We'll let him work through his own issues. I'm sorry, man. I'm really trying not to, but your minions are so bad. Our dummy's getting cotton everywhere. Pitiful. Do I have to get him mad enough at his own minions that he changes them? I've forgotten. Okay, so I do have to... There we go. Okay. Everyone is fired. I'm so sorry guys, I tried to spare you. Relying on people that aren't garbage. That is my true power too, man. Magic missile. Let's try again. It's not like you can kill him while you're hitting his dummy. I'm pretty sure that I did kill him at one point, or at least I broke his dummy and that counted. Like, I got XP from it. Ah! Well, that was bad. You look nice today! Your HP was maxed out. Oop. I was doing so well there. No way! These guys are even worse than the other guys! Who cares? Doesn't need friends. He has knives! out of knives. But it doesn't matter! Nobody can be hurt, we will be stuck fighting him forever. Various evil laughs. He is out of here. And our saviour arrives! Sorry, he interrupted us. As soon as he came over, your friend immediately left. Oh no, you guys look like you are having fun. Oh no, I, I just wanted to say hi. Oh no. Well, I'm going to head home now. Oh, um. Feel free to come with if you want, but no pressure. Dog 13! Not sure if that should count. Hmm. Flirt with the ghost. I will go ahead and flirt with the ghost if we can. No worries, just thought I'd offer. Ghost date! Hey, my house is up here. In case you want to see, or in case you don't. You feel a calming tranquility. You're filled with determination. We will head up to Nafstablook. Oh, you really came. Sorry, I wasn't expecting that. It's not much, but we can make ourselves at home. 